Hey everyone, it's up North Collectors here. We are opening up a bunch of random baseball card packs. We have uh, mainly 2020, 2021 packs in here. So let's see what we have. Um, we have some of the newest products as well as some that came out earlier this year and later last year. Yeah, I'd say we probably have like 25 or 26 packs would be my guess. I didn't actually count them though. So a 2021 series two jumbo pack. Let's say 20 plus packs. How about that? There you go. 2021 Diamond Kings Baseball. Uh, two Series 2 Hobby Packs. Two Dunruss Hobby Packs. Two Bowman Hobby Packs. That's a fun one. Bowman Draft is coming out here pretty soon. Uh, I believe that comes out just after Christmas. As of right now. Two 2021 Tops Update Hobby Packs. We've got a Hobby Exclusive Silver Pack. A Heritage Minor League Hobby Pack, a Bowman Heritage Pack, and a Ginter Chrome Pack. And then we've got a Bowman's Best Pack, a Bowman Chrome Pack, Pro Debut Hobby, uh, Top's Finest, Gypsy Queen, and 2021 Heritage. And then we've got an Opening Day 2021. Two Allen and Ginter. Two more Heritage. We have three Heritage packs in here, I guess. I don't know. Uh, Interesting. I don't know what the other one may have been uh, an older year. No, it, it also said 2021. So I don't, no, know. I don't know why we have two boxes open. Interesting. Uh, and then 2021 Tops Stadium Club and 2020 Tops Stadium Club. I think the other one was minor league. Maybe. I don't know. The packs do look different. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right there. Minor yep. League. yep, that's yep. why. That's why. Because they're very that's similar, why. but they have that little minor league emblem on the side. All right, opening day. So I didn't count the packs totally, but there's definitely over 20. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, so looking forward to some of the other stuff that will come out here. It's kind of funny. You say Bowman Draft is going to come out in January. That was always like a November yeah, release. Yeah, early November release. Uh, <laughs> Bowman's Best has always been a December release. Yep. That is coming out pretty soon. Uh, I think it comes out like maybe the week after Bowman Draft. I'd have to look to be 100% sure, but I think it I does come remember. out after Draft yeah. just a little bit. So Everything seems to get pushed back a little bit. Um, Heritage High number came out this week. And what is that? Some kind I don't of know, something weird. Gold. Gold. Nice. Uh, Asheville Tourists. That is going to be numbered. Wow, out of 18. 11 of 18. No Nova? Yeah, Fridus Nova. Cool. I don't know a ton or anything about this guy. About Nova? So. Yeah, I don't know either. I do remember seeing him in some other products, but that's about it. Yeah, let us know if he is... Um, a baller. A baller. A certified baller. Or just... A good baseball player. Heritage Heritage High Number came out yesterday. There's a Joe Adele rookie. Yeah, we got and a box of that coming. Conforto. There's a Mateo. Tatis, Cruz, and MVP. This year's Heritage is really difficult to try to find uh, the SPs and stuff just because the backs, all half of them all look different. So uh, we'll do update next. So 2021 tops update. Another more recent release. Uh, there's a lot of this stuff on the shelves by us. A ton of it. Yes, a ton very, of it. Very, very easy to find. A ton of it. Yep. So. That and any Panini baseball product yes. you could ever dream of, pretty much. All Mosaic, over the place. Uh, to, um, what's the other one? Uh, not not Prism. Well, do they have Prism still? Uh, yeah, Prism, Prism Baseball is still out there. And yep. what, what's the other one, though? It's not Mosaic, not Prism. There's one other one. Chronicles. That, yeah, Chronicles. Yep. Yeah, so there's a bunch of it laying around. There's a bunch of it been out for weeks uh chronicles draft basketball has been sitting out now for a while so there's a few different things you can they're gonna go back to the old days of actually having discounts yeah 40 percent off imagine their mj holdings gonna have to do something they have to they they're sitting on a lot of stuff well, also myers prices are ridiculous compared to most other places right so. yeah because i know one of our viewers said the Blasters of Heritage High number, I think, were twenty bucks over yeah, at their Walmart. Walmart. So that makes sense, especially now that baseball is, you know, if they're making so much of it and they just can't charge for it anymore. Nick Marcakis, uh, Rainbow Foil, and Stanton. 
Yeah, so obviously, I think we said something about this before, but uh, here in Michigan, the Javi Baez trade is a big deal. People right. are excited to get him. So that'll be interesting to see all that plays out. I'm assuming there'll still be a few more uh, free agent deals here coming up that we'll start to hear about, but we'll see. Marquez Ramirez, Clark Schmidt rated rookie. Yeah, they've got all these uh, different SPs Funky in here. Don Ross. Statue of Liberty. Brad Hand. Things. Dallas Keuchel out of 2021. And Austin Meadows Blue, which are in every pack in that stuff. Uh, 2021 Allen and Ginter. Allen and Ginter, you absolutely never know what you're going to get. Yeah, you can get <clears throat> nothing or you can pull something massive out of the stuff. Marco Bueller. Tiana. Oh, birds Canadian. of the feather. Orange bellied parrot. We still haven't had our parrot make an appearance on the, the channel. So maybe we'll have to do that. Our dogs made several, either barking or under the table. We got a shot of her here and there, I believe. Um, but our bird? No, has not been featured. No, it's not been featured. So birds of the feather. Filler. Legacy lithographs. Clayton Kershaw. Man, so far your your packs have not Duds. been. Well, uh, I got the one. Great, I got the one card numbered out of eighteen. Right. But other than that, no. But I still have the heavy hitters. But you did. Here, you so. did get some nice uh, packs in your stack there to yet. Yeah, open. at the bottom, right? So we'll right. see. Uh, Hilliard, Rodriguez, Posada, Black, and then a Sororka and a Zach Collins rookie. Um, we'll do Ginter first. I don't go we'll do it like that. Yeah, the prices of baseball are definitely dropping because Blowout had um, Heritage High number for like under a hundred bucks. That's like the first time I've seen a ba hobby. Yeah, for a, under hundred hobby box be that low. I mean, they used to be 50, 60 bucks, so still high, but right, starting to high. come back to earth a little bit. Uh, Bowman time. Let's see. I don't see anything thick in here so Luis Garcia rookie Sixto Jordan would love to get a blade that's cool futurist Bobby Witt Jr. yeah would love to pull a Blaze Jordan autograph uh, he's looked really really good so for the Red Sox tops finest 2021 I always love finest Let's see if we pull something up. green you know. picked out the packs did you pick out like the autograph pack you probably did I have no idea. Oh, you I did. did. It's not a terrible one, actually. Dalton <clears throat> Varsho. He's got a sweet autograph. People seem to like him, too, so that's yeah. cool. And this is a Blake Snell. Oh, Ooh, what is threw that? It. Oh, that's one of the new um, parallels, the green. Out of 125. Those are really cool looking. Those are cool looking. Dalton. That Dalton uh, autograph is beautiful. Yeah, people I've seen. I've actually sold a couple of his cards recently. Yeah, I don't know people if he, are pretty yeah, high I mean, on him. People seem to like him, so pretty cool. Uh, not too bad, so at least we did get one something there in a Clayton Kershaw. Yeah, always good to get a autograph, especially of a, one of the guys that's a little bit better in the draft class. Boom, oh, we've got a thick one in here too. Looks like a blue, maybe a blue auto. Somebody really good, that'd be cool. Nick York, Casey Mize, rookie. Blackman is like a blue, just blue. First, Royals. Oh, it is an auto. Wow. Oh, sweet. Tyler Gentry, outfielder, first out of 150. To look this guy up in a yeah, second. 76 overall, third round pick. It's not bad. Not bad. Um, third round pick. Yeah. Cool. Uh, I don't know why, but I always love the uh, baseball autographs. Uh, Definitely. They're not all great, but uh oh, my penny sleeves are flying everywhere. I'm gonna let you open up some packs. You gotta I try to get phone too, so I can give them a little look see. I try to get um some penny sleeves out, and they went flying. Oh, almost flying everywhere. Almost. Just gonna move the camera over a bit. All right, let's do start with the uh, stadium club. Well, my phone's talking to Luke. So let's see what we have here. Stadium club. Always a fun product. No idea if we have hit the auto out of this, but let me get it centered on the camera. Probably our viewers would know better than we would. It gets so confusing to even know what is up on the shelf and what 
products we pulled autographs out of. Some sometimes it's pretty memorable, but Tyler, the Tyler's like a thirty dollar autograph, so nothing super crazy. Yeah. So one of those mid usually usually the way Bowman Chrome works is usually if you get a really good autograph, it's gonna be an international signing. That's how it tends to be. Right. Um usually the really good draft picks are gonna be and remember we spent a long time Traded. trying to figure those out. Right. Um, They're actually part of the regular set, right? Yeah. Yeah. But usually you're gonna get um the good draft picks in Bowman Draft or regular Bowman. Allen and Ginter. Oh, like we said, always a fun set. Um, Vaughn and Sino and Cal Ripken. Historical hits. Insert. All right. Gypsy Queen. Gypsy Queen, one of the first products that we really got into when we got back into baseball, 2013, was it? Yes, or 14, I think. Maybe it was 14, yeah. Chris Bryant uh, and Bowman that year. Yeah. That, Bowman and... That was fun. Yeah, Gypsy Queen, in my opinion, has gone downhill a little bit over the past few yeah, years. Yeah. Just because have... it used to get it used to get like four hits, two relics. Yep. They had minis all over the place. Got a ton of different colored... I mean, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun, but... Pro debut. Let's see what we get out of this uh, pack here. This stuff actually sells really, really well. Pro debut? Yeah. Really? Yes. Especially the, if you get the chromes that are like the jumbos. Oh, yeah. Those sell super well. Yeah, you know, I saw that the um, price of those was not, did not drop much. Um, well, let's do this pack here. And people seem to like them, so. Yeah. Well, they look they look cool because they look like the series, you know, one. Yeah, exactly. Flagship stuff, but yeah, it's minor league, so. Exactly. A little bit better looking than some of the other. Yeah, and some people just don't cards. like heritage, you know. So right. They'd right. Much rather have an autograph or a chrome or whatever it might be. So. Now, if we're skipping anybody, you see here we miss a hit, obviously. Or a you know short person than tell us, but um, interesting the combo cards. Some of these sometimes I look at these. I'm like, God, I don't remember seeing those too much. Let's do. We didn't open hardly any. Yeah, open up one hobby box. Right, we didn't. Yeah, we didn't open up a lot of update at all. I mean, there's I don't know who you'd really chase in there this year. Yeah, the last two years of update have not been it's been tough like the years before. Earl Hershiser, that's pretty cool. Aaron Judge, Mike Trout with a mask, Jack Flaherty. Auto. Oh, autograph. Monte Harrison. There we go. This guy signs a lot. Monte Harrison. So, hey, what is that, third autograph? Paul you, Goldschmidt. Yeah. He sells okay. I actually just sold the same exact card like a week ago. Oh, really? Yeah. Like eight dollars. He something. he's he signs a lot though, huh? Yeah. Well, you looked and it up and stuff. you were like, "We got a black in there." Was that a black? What did I no. see? No. Oh, and I just saw the back. It's of one card. of those uh, whatever the year. Oh, 19, the, the tops were due ones. Right, right. You know. Um. Yeah. So you, what did you do? Get that in a in a lot in of a some lot, kind. Yeah. And then you looked them up and you just saw all the signatures. It is. Yeah, it is an autograph. David Peter, wow, we're doing well on this That's one. Weird. What was that? I don't know. Series two hobby. This was, yeah, yeah was. series two hobby right here. Cool. Yeah, interesting. Autos are usually pretty tough out of that. Yeah, so. this is a hobby box, so those are really tough. Four autos so far. Yeah, nice. Four autos. It's December. It's the season of giving, so we are getting. The packs are giving it to us. Packs are definitely giving us. Well, let's do a back to back Ooh. series two. Why not? Well, guys, hopefully you are doing well. And we know, obviously, this can get to be a very busy time of year. Christmas, New Year's, all that stuff. So hopefully you are staying healthy and doing well. Let us know what you think of this break. Did you have a favorite pack, product? What are you looking forward to coming out around Christmas time? Hopefully Santa Claus will bring you your favorite box and if you're anywhere near grand rapids this week i'll be at the legend show set up again this month so if you want to come say hi or hang out 
Yes, in fact, did you see the email of the I young did, man actually. who was wondering if you were going to be replied. there? Yeah, cool. So here is a rainbow foil. That's actually a really awesome looking the card. The picture and a foil. Yeah, yeah, those are sweet. We have a, a Ford. Oh, it's only a foily one. Foily yeah, one. Yep. Ones. Those are all new this year. Yep, those are new. I like the I like the new ones they've added though. Yeah, they actually look good. They look good, right? It's not like they just well, added they some to, junk. Do you remember in like twenty like thirteen fifteen yeah. they had those canary? I don't think right. they were numbered, but they had like the red canary. Yeah, ones and yeah, and they had they had stuff like that. They yeah. had the what was it? Um, sparkle. Oh, and Bowman. Yeah, Bowman ice. Yeah, the parallel. ice. Yep. Yep. And so they then they kind of did away with it. And they kind of bring it back, but those are the ones in platinum too. Now they still have those same parallels. In I platinum. like what sticks out there. Scott's yes. fertilizer, kind of like free advertisement for them on baseball cards too. Um, yeah, that yeah it is. So that's a good addition. Like I mean, people complain, oh, there's so many parallels and stuff, which is which can you know that's a legitimate argument. However, it is fun when they're actually good parallels and you like to pull least, them. Yeah, at least they look cool. All right, let's do this heritage one first because I have a feeling that Bowman's gonna have something massive in it. Actually, I hope so. I'm. I don't think so. I just have wishful Blaze thinking. Blaze Jordan Super Fractor, Austin Martin Super. Ooh, we've pulled one Super Fractor in our lifetime, and we've opened up a lot of packs. Yes. So that tells you how hard it is. Last time we got a Possum Gold autograph out of one of those uh, Bowman Heritage packs. Oh, yeah, we did, didn't we? Speaking of heritage, if anybody knows if that's coming out again this year, I looked the other day. I don't think I saw it on a release yeah. calendar. So. You know what, though? It came out really late. Yeah. I it think came it out in December, maybe even January. Yeah. It was it was late. I mean, unless I'm having a, a memory lapse. But all right, here's Bowman. Let's see. Jacob DeGrom, he stinks. Just kidding. All right. There he Bobby, is. The, the new, new tiger. tiger. The goat. Cruz Nova. Isn't that the guy we got autograph of? No, gold. Oh, go yeah, sorry, gold, right? Yep. Not autograph, gold. Aguero. Oh, Cruz. Again. Rutledge and Larnick. Larnick. All right, let's open up the silver pack. We've these, done a while out of these. Yeah, this year. we've, we've done Joe really Adel good. Auto yeah, something else. Something we got a Joe Adele parallel, and we got. I don't know. So, some of them are low numbered. Is that beef in the back? Looks like beef. All right. It's not. Okay, maybe I'm maybe I'm wishful thinking. Uh, Isabel. Yeah, I was. Pujols. Pujols. I just saw that mixed with the other one, Lindor, <laughs> and that. So nothing crazy out of that one. Bowman's best. Bowman's Give best. Us a Boba Shet. Give Super us something. I think I think though we've already got all the good stuff out of this box. Isn't this the last pack in there? Yeah, it's the last pack. Yeah. I think we did, but Zach Green, Joey Bart, Dustin, Dustin May, Dustin. Riley Green. That's cool. I like those cards. And then Make Miguel it, Cabrera. Good Tigers back there. Yeah. All right. Well, there you have it, guys. Pretty good overall. I mean, we didn't get any any like big, huge dollar cards, we did but well it, did though. pretty well. A lot of hits. So it's always fun. We don't know what we're gonna get unless Luke kind of searched the packs with those X-ray glasses and and looked. I don't know. All you need is a scale and a blow dryer. Right. And some sharp scissors and whatever else. Go watch. Uh, who was that? Dave Sports Cards or something that did a video. No. Like that. Oh, maybe it was. Yeah, he someone did some. Did a, yeah, yeah, prank video. yeah, prank Funny. videos. There's a lot of actually. If you want to just roam around YouTube aimlessly, just look for like prank. Don't type in prank videos, but like put in pack searching uh, sports card. Yeah. <laughs> Tutorial or something like that. You'll, You'll find, find some, some interesting stuff. stuff. Um, yeah, we can't endorse any of it because I can't speak for it. But um, some of it, I'm sure, would be very funny. All right, well, thanks for watching, guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you in the next break. Uh, if you uh, haven't yet, uh, uh, hit that little bell icon. Hit that bell icon. You'll be notified when we post our next break. Luke is going to be setting up at the Legends Show in Grand Rapids, hopefully, this weekend, and getting footage there. So we'll have a video of that. We'll have Heritage High Number and whatever else we can find. Maybe some good retail stuff again. Last week, we hit the jackpot with those uh, mega mystery mega box. I'm going to so. the other Meyer this weekend to see if they have them there. So uh, maybe yeah, maybe we'll have more it, of them. But you never know. The basketball ones were fire. In fact, yeah, yeah, we might.
open another one of those. Who knows? We don't have any more. No, I know. But I said if we get another one. Oh yeah. Maybe, no, we maybe, maybe we'll open one on the channel. Yes. All right. Fun. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.